So hello Prerna, hello Govind, how are you guys? Hello Pawan, I'm good, thank you. Hey Pawan. Hi. So how has been your last week? Good for me. Yes, it's been good for me too. I've gone through my personality assessment. I've really enjoyed learning good. various aspects of myself. Okay. getting to know myself a little more okay okay so uh, what did you found uh, what did you find uh, new uh, after rereading the report i mean could you find just, something different just uh, reflecting on some traits and connecting with understanding those traits okay that, that was what interested me that's very good that's very good that's very good. govin what about you yeah, Pawan, uh, yeah, it's good, like uh, the progress and all, I'm very much uh, looking forward to it. Okay, all right. So guys, uh, today we will have another very exciting activity. And the name of the activity is the Wheel of Life. Okay. And uh, Wheel of Life activity will help you to understand the various aspects of your life, you know. For example, uh, career, growth, business, fun and recreation, relationships, position, wealth, love life. You know, these are various, uh, et cetera, et cetera. You know, these are various aspects of one's, uh, you know, life. So uh, this wheel of life activity will help you to understand the current status of these aspects. And uh, you have to we, uh, go through a a tool which I will broadcast to both of you. A small instruction which is related to this broadcast tool is that there are going to be a series of the questions. To every question, you have to scale from one to 10, where 10 becomes the highest one. So means uh, where you uh, want to give the highest marks, you can go up to 10, you know. Uh, try to avoid giving five, uh, as rating to any question, you know, because uh, that neither uh, gives us an understanding uh, that whether it is an improvement area or it is a progressive area. So it is good where you feel that, you know, it has to be given five, try to give it to four or six, you know, uh, uh, once you go through the question, have a proper thought and go into the background and uh, try to scale like that only. Okay, so uh, please uh, complete this exercise and uh, we will meet you again, you know. Okay, so uh, so complete, uh, I think by, by tomorrow you will be in a position to complete that? Yes. All right. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah. So now the one day is over. So... Uh, Hi, Prerna. Yesterday, you know, um, we had met and uh, this uh, broadcast tool, uh, the tool was broadcasted on the Wheel of Life. Govind, I'm sure you might have also done the activity. So may I request both of you to share the results of uh, your Wheel of Life? So we can start with Prerna. Yes. Sure. Yeah. So Prerna, uh, in the... let me know the, uh, numbers, you know, first. Yes. So in uh, in the wheel of life, uh, at, I see myself rating at health at number six. Six. Okay. Friends. Uh, yes. Friends and family at number seven. Okay. Fun and recreation at number eight. Okay. And uh, yes, but right now because of COVID, I would say it's a number uh, four. Otherwise, I see myself rating at number eight. So wealth, you're talking relation, about, sorry, sorry, you're talking about wealth. Wealth is four right now. No. Fun and recreation. Fun and recreation is four. Okay. Then uh, relationship is four. Personal growth is eight. Just one second. Relationship is? Four. Four. Personal, uh, personal growth is eight. Okay. Wealth and possessions is four. Mm -hmm. And career is at two. It's two. 
Okay. All right. So before I go to Govind, uh, Prerna, I have a question for you. Uh, tell me which are the strongest areas and which are the weakest areas as per this wheel of life of yours, you know? Uh, I feel my strongest area is personal growth, which I have uh, taken at number eight. Mm -hmm. And uh, my weakest is career. It's at two. Is at two. Correct. All right. So, uh, good to know that your strongest area is uh, your uh, learning and personal growth and weakest area is career. Uh, tell me, uh, now, after understanding this wheel of life and strongest and weakest areas of your life, which area do you think you should uh, critically work on with immediate effect, you know? Okay, I feel I should work on my career because uh, all my life I've been a homemaker, hmm. but I've always thought that uh, I would want to do something more other than, uh, like I said, community service and everything. I would like to make a career of myself. So that's where I need to focus on, which would even uh, probably give me financial freedom which I'm looking for. Okay, okay. You have given a, a four to your wealth and position. You have given four to your relationships. You yes. have given four to fun, leisure and recreation as well. Right? Yes. So, uh, do you find these areas also as weak areas? Uh. Yes, I feel uh, where fun and recreation is concerned, probably it's because right now we are on a lockdown. So we don't get a chance to connect with friends and family and uh, have, have spent as much as time with them. So as of today, I do find it at a low area. Okay. And probably when I, if I work on my career, it would uh, give me financial freedom and probably give me the, a better uh, possessions. And, uh, and why do you think your relationship is for? Uh, why do I think uh, my relationship is at four? Is uh, because uh, I feel that uh, I am like uh, a little busy with uh, my community service and uh, uh, like my NGO. So I find like I sometimes need to put more time into my relationship than what I actually do. Okay. All right. So I need to create a balance. Okay. So do you think that right now the critical areas where you want to work on immediately uh, are you are you very clear that is it only career or you want to take one more area to work on along with career? I would look at uh, working on uh, career and relationships. Career and relationships. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. So, uh, Govind, I come to you and uh, kindly uh, let me know uh, the... Uh, scores you have given to the various aspects of your life. So we can start yeah, with, uh, uh, with health. Health is nine. Health is nine. Friends and family is six. Okay. Fun recreation is seven. Seven. Wealth is three. Health is three. Relationship is three. Relationship is three. Personal growth is seven. Okay. Position is eight. Okay. Career is six. Career is six. All right. So, Govind, the, the same question goes to you. Uh, tell me the strongest areas as well as the weakest areas as per your wheel of life. Okay. So, my strongest areas are health and uh, position. 
so mm. in health uh, area like i have uh, really put efforts uh, to get in shape and quit a bad habit of uh, smoking so that's why i have uh, really i mean achieved a milestone in that so that makes me uh, rate myself uh, nine in that area mm. and when it comes to position i'm quite uh, content with whatever i have because i always look at you know like having things that are of quality rather than of quantity so things what ever i have they are of a premium kind and i'm very much satisfied the things i purchase at a late uh, but still then i'm happy with them the things which i have so so those things are there yes and so when it comes to uh, the weakest areas uh, the, the wealth and relationship so these two areas is something i need to uh, look into probably relationship is uh, less because uh, i am still not uh, uh, married or in a relationship so that's what uh, is hitting me in that area so that's where i need to focus on so and when it comes to health uh, sorry wealth i have rated myself 3 because i find myself uh, wealth in terms of people rather in uh, rather a sense of a bank balance so so when you come to money aspect uh, it is uh, not much of a significance for me yes it matters but up to our level that's how i see so when you when when i rate myself uh, wealth as 3 probably it's because the people around me are not empowered so indirectly i am not feeling empowered so that is the reason i have rated myself 3 okay very good uh, you know good descriptions you have given you know okay uh govin uh now uh after this complete understanding which areas do you think you should critically work on uh on immediate basis you know so i'm other than this like i'm i'm looking for my uh career that i need to focus on so currently as i said i'm a software professional hmm. so uh i'm not quite content with it uh, because uh, i mean Uh, the place which i mean it could be dream for uh, many people uh, you know uh, people could be aspiring for my place but uh, being said that for me it isn't uh, that great so i am looking for options like uh, probably becoming a coach so that is an option that i have kept so so i am not satisfied with what i am doing probably i am it okay. that's the reason probably you are given six you know yes okay all right so you find that you need to work on career with immediate basis you know yes okay would you mind to uh, add uh, other few areas along with uh, career uh, as critical areas to work on so i see personal growth uh, going in hand with career as of now because uh, probably there are certain skills i may need to develop uh, that may relate to personal growth also so it is fine for me that is a revelation a revelation that i just now co- i mean came to have and second thing is fun and recreation no sorry uh, fa- friends and family yeah that is another thing i i will be focusing on because uh, due to all this uh, that i am going through probably i am a bit disconnected uh, with my friends so i probably need to touch with face with them on a regular basis just to check with you since you have given uh, uh, you know your relationship as three and you told me that the, this is the weakest area in your wheel of life uh, are you planning to take it as one of your critical areas to work on yes okay so this means you are taking right now career as your uh, critical area to work on you are taking relationships as your critical another critical area to work on am i correctly understanding yes. uh, govin yes absolutely okay all right uh, i i also feel uh, i'm sure you will agree with me uh, in wealth you have told me that it is another weakest area but since you are taking career uh, as your critical area to work on probably you are thinking that wealth is connected with that uh yes yes i find that now yes 
So probably you're not taking it as an extra area to work on. So once you work on the career, wealth will be yes. taken care of. Yes, you are right. Okay, all right. So uh, good, uh, you know, now uh, guys, you are aware of the state of various areas of your life. So we need to move ahead. So uh, we'll meet next time. So thank you so much uh, for uh, this session. It was really an amazing session. And I'm finding that this journey is really becoming incredible now. And let's meet next week and we'll talk something else with some uh, another exciting greatest tool. So thank you so much. And we'll meet next time. Thank you, Pawan. Thank you. Thank you.